All right, good afternoon, YouTubers, to another installment of the restoration of our 1992 Corvette convertible hardtop. What we're going to do, if you've been following me in the last few videos I've posted, I have managed to repair our suspension for now. I need to do a little more adjustment with our um, rear camber and caster settings, but otherwise, it's actually drivable right now. I did drive it about 20 miles just to see how it would handle it does okay but as you can see there's a little more close-up of our damage repair we're going to need to make but as you can see this is very filthy um, this car sat if you watch my first video it sat behind a mobile home for 16 months in the grass wasn't even on a driveway so it really did not do it any favors. You may be able to see here, uh, it literally, the paint just burned right off of it in this South Texas sun. So it did not do it any favors. And it's got filth and snails on it. There's actually a, a snail, which is quite funny. Um, but under the dirt, somehow somebody broke this too, so I'll be replacing that. But you can see the Whitewash through the clear coat, well, not whitewash, but the white out, I should say. Weather stripping got burned, door sills got burned up, messed up. I mean, this car, honest to goodness, has mold growing on it from sitting in a grassy environment. For you guys up north, it may not be as a common thing, but down here we get it a lot with the humidity in the air gross will actually attach themselves to the cars so interesting kind of thing but what I'm gonna do is go ahead and give this car a bath I want to see what happens once I wash it and see how much less miserable it looks before I begin to do body work on it so if you will check back with me or actually I'm gonna wash this and check back in and we'll see how it looks so see you in a second 